Hey everyone, so it's February 2018 and I decided I wanted to start vlogging. Why? Um, it's only going to be for me for let's say, two reasons. Number one, it would be something like my journal because I think keeping journal is something really important and I'm not the writer type of guy. So with this, I mean how often did you have great ideas or you want to work on something and then half a year or a year later you kind of forgot about them because there's just too many distractions or you want to see your progress but you can't really check so this will help me to see and trace progress as well as it will make me accountable for what I want to do and what I say and the journal is going to be about finding my purpose I think that's really important in life to have your purpose something you, you get up for that drives you every day and something that's bigger than you that you enjoy working on because that will lead to a fulfilled life. And number two would be actually in the States, when I was studying the States for a while, one of my roommates, she always made clips or little short videos when we traveled somewhere or we did something and then later on he would edit something and make a really great video out of it. And that's like an amazing memory. And I thought that was a really, really cool idea. So with this, I might get both in one. So let's just try it. So I started mapping down uh, or writing down a um, mind map. Definitely not complete. It's gonna grow. It's small. It's simple. But that's one of the things I want to do and see where it will lead me. I definitely need one of those whiteboards, just really, really big ones. I love whiteboards. They're amazing to work on it, to scratch ideas. It's so easy to erase, to go right again, stand, they'll go back two, three meters and just look at it, look at it. So that's one of the first things I'm planning to do. So um, for my career, so what I studied or just finished my master's is aerospace engineering. And I think Actually, I feel that I want to start an airline. An airline, um, I also guess because I'm a more generalist kind of person, not a really specialist. I really love airplanes. I love seeing the whole product, the whole thing. And maybe in that, that case, maintenance or airline ops. We'll see about that. So, um, definitely kind of plays into what I want to see your work is kind of international environment. Due to, I have a lot of, let's say for my age, I was lucky to have quite a lot of international experiences. I got or received education in four different countries on three different continents. So that's something um, I really benefit from and I want to take into my job, my career, because I think it can benefit others. And I think an airline is a company that works, acts worldwide, so it's really beneficial for that. Um, as you can see, like this was one of the branches which I'll have to still work on and still a lot more stuff. The other thing is, didn't know how to, to title it, I just called it Lifestyle. Um, more referring to training mind and body. And these are things I'm currently doing or starting to, to improve or want to do. Okay, besides exercise, um, I, love, I love going to the gym. Everything has to do with fitness a little bit. Nutrition, I think, is really, really important, no matter what. I started two, three years ago doing cryobiological nutrition. have to get more tr tr on track on that. It's really amazing how that benefited me in terms of overall performance and these things. Um, mobility is a really big thing now because I am way too stiff because I never... No, oh, that's German, actually. That's a German expression. I am not really flexible, let's say that way. I started working on it three, four weeks ago. It's going to take me a lot of work. I do enjoy it a lot. Um, right now, I'd say, say I I'm doing mobility exercise like five times a week, a few minutes after training session. And on, let's say, my rest days, I take an hour or two. It's hard to see progress. I hope in three months I'll have a little bit of progress. It would be really amazing if I could do a split one day. Um, books. Uh, Reading books, audiobooks, kind of the same. I usually like releasing audiobooks a little bit. can be 10, 20 minutes in the morning while breakfast, just to get my day started a little bit. Books, um, in terms of everything has to do with health. 
especially with mind, I love how your your mindset has such an influence on your life and training that is really important. And right now what I'm thinking about is trying to start a little bit of health monitoring more. It can be super simple, checking on weight. Um, there's a measurement I want to take. Maybe I'll try to make a video of that, which kind of shows how which environmental environmental Actually, I don't really know the word. Effects like metals and that kind of stuff do have a bad influence on you, and you can you can check and trace how high the values are to try to, to work on to get that more balanced. So these things all ultimately leave, lead to, I tell it, a healthy life, healthy, happy life, because I think health is something really important. Without a good health, you can't perform, you can't have, you can't be happy, you can't have happy relationships, you can't do your best at your job. So. These are things that I'm going to map out, try to do bigger, and what currently drives me, or I'd say, is my passion about. And hopefully one day, these two things, my career and my lifestyle, okay, I don't want to write on here, will match together and be one thing. If not, be super aligned and work out together well. That's kind of the goal, or working on these things in terms of finding my purpose. So... Now it's time to pack my stuff, going to the gym, catch up later. <laughs>